our new favorite coffee spot here in San Marcos. Um, it's kind of not where you would expect it to be. Because you have to go down an alleyway. I promise there's coffee around the corner. My name is Tyler Tineco, I own Cafe Azteca here in San Marcos, Texas. Um, this is my trailer. This is the Fetco machine. So this guy uh, is where I make all my drip coffee on. It's really, really cool, really lifesaver. Um, and this is my espresso machine. It's a three group head, so I can make three drinks at the same time. The little logo there. So yeah, it's, this, is, this thing is a beast. I really love this guy. Pulls really, really good shots. And when did you start it? 2017. So yeah, I opened uh, 2017, but before that, I did farmer's markets, so it was really, really fun. So, But as a full, like, Monday through Saturday type thing, uh, it's about a year ago, 2017. And then you were telling me about cold brews. Yes. So, so you specialize in those. Yeah, so okay. cold brew, we, we really, really take pride in our cold brew. Um, so we let it steep for about 24 hours. Um, right now we're using the White Elephant from Mexico, and then uh, Yurgachev from um, Free Bean in Luling. So these two are really, really, really good, really recommendable. What's the biggest tip that you have for anybody making cold brew at home? Cold brew, just get good good coffee and a good uh, recipe. So right now I use one to 16, one gram of coffee to 16 grams of water. So that's really the secret. It's the mm -hmm. cold brew, is, I'm sorry, is the coffee. So make sure it's craft coffee, make sure the label has a roasted date on it, as most should. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, make sure you do a really, really good recipe. So 1 to 16 is typically where you'll find the best uh, tasting cold brew. All right, show of hands in the comments, who here knew that Matt and I both played tennis in high school? played consistently in years but him and I were just talking about how I feel like I've played recently like muscle memory is awesome Yes, I am winning. Five to four. <laughs> First to three, huh? First to three. We're already at five four. So you have to win by two in tennis, and so we just keep like I win one, she wins one, but I keep kind of getting one up. He won. We kept going back and forth, and what you won? We got up to seven, didn't seven we? Seven to five. Seven yeah. To five. Seven. So. We originally planned on doing first to three, <laughs> 12. We actually played a six game set, technically. Yeah, you, yeah, we did. You have to win by two, like he said. And so we kept evening out. We kept going four, four, five, five. Whew, but that was fun. I really miss tennis. Um, we were gonna jump in the water, but we don't have towels. So, fun little fact, we haven't even told you guys. Today is our five year wedding anniversary. We didn't even tell you guys. Yeah. Happy anniversary. Same to you. It's like I was telling it to you guys. Happy anniversary. Yeah. And we've probably been doing YouTube since we've been married. I think so. Almost. At least the one year. Yeah. No, I started right after we got married. Interesting. What are we doing for our anniversary dinner? Hun? Uh, uh, sandwiches? <laughs> I don't Fancy. know. Fancy. <laughs> I don't know. Good game.
We need gloves. This is all within a 20 foot vicinity of this one area. Seriously, I don't understand why people can't clean up after themselves. Brady! What are you doing, Brady? Brady, you can't eat the seaweed. Buzz. Hi, Buzz. There's Buzz. Bye, Buzz. Good boy. Did he drop it? No, oh, he dropped the seaweed. He had it in his mouth. with carrying it. <laughs> Brady, Brady, stop eating seaweed. <laughs> like hungry, hungry hippo. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> ready, 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 ready. Get it. Oh, big splash. Get it, Buzz. Get it, Buzz. Oh, get, it. get it, Buzz! Get it, Buzz! Get it! Get it, Buzz! Get it! Get it! Get it, Buzz! Get it! Get that rock! Look on. at that! Oh, get Come on! Come on! Go! Y'all are both gonna get swept away. Go! Go! <laughs> Another shoe. Oh no! I'll get it. So what started as a trip to the river with the dogs ended up as a clean up the river project. I'm really amazed at how much trash there is out here and it makes me so angry. I wish we'd brought a large trash bag with us. Well, see you later. I got Brady. Brady! Says rental only. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, in huge letters on the back. Oh, that's nice. What are you doing, Buzz? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Brady's just gonna follow behind. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> Buzz, look at you! Yay, Buzz! <laughs> oh, Brady. <laughs> Was that fun, Buzz?
All right, so where are we going? Oh, did you already tell them the idea? All right, so my idea is I, I have a drink specifically that I like. And it's, uh, it's actually from the area, and so in Texas. It's out of Blanco, Blanco, Texas. A little backstory on this this company, Real Ale. And so it's, it's a beer company. But what they do on their bottle cap, you know, like, I don't even know, Snapple and things like that, they'll put things on the, the bottle cap. They actually put cities of Texas. And so my idea is... It, and not all cities in Texas are always the best to go visit. You know, some are good for living in, right? But um, my idea is, why not put it up to chance? And you, you guys can let me know if, if you like the idea and I'll continue this, but I'm gonna pop this bottle real quick and then I'm gonna see where we might end up going. So let me know. Let's see. <laughs> see what area we get. Hey, that's not bad. Dripping Springs. Do you know what's in Dripping Springs, hey. Blair? Hey, skull and cake bones. Well, okay, yeah, there's a, a vegan place that we like. <laughs> there's also Rhymer's Ranch. That's dripping? That's Dripping Springs. Let's commit to it. You wanna do this? With the RV? Yeah. We don't have to go like, you know, this weekend, but we'll figure it out. Maybe uh, we'll start this after Vegas or something. But yeah, let's do this. So Wait. the first one on the, uh, we'll name this, this series too as well, but the Touring Texas series or something like that. Dripping Springs. So that's our first place. That's the first place we're going. All right, leaving it up to the old beer bottles. Yeah, leaving it up to <laughs> chance. Why not? Is it recording? Yeah, it is. Do you want to say hey, guys? <laughs> I don't know. When you forget how to vlog. Yeah. All right, so I don't. We, I don't know where to start this. Because it's all over the place, yeah, kind of. That's our life. That's our life. So basically what you guys just saw was whenever Matt... No, we're just recapping. <laughs> so we're going to Dripping Springs. <laughs> yeah, so I think I'm going to really... I'm, I'm going to commit to that. So I want to be able to like basically pop a bottle when I, I guess whenever we... Bottle. Yeah, pop a bottle. <laughs> yeah, I know. It sounds ridiculous. Um, but yeah, I want to do that kind of every time we decide that we want to take a trip or want to decide the next trip. What I'll do is I'll just grab one of those, and they always have a city in Texas. Mm -hmm. So, and there's obviously places that we want to go. I will say but no so to many certain places. places, probably. Okay, I'll, <laughs> I'll give you a couple vetoes, <laughs> but we'll see. But uh, yeah, so I mean, we're we're gonna do that. So Dripping Springs, we're already conceptualizing it and everything, and so. Uh, there's a few things that we like to do in that area, and so uh, we're looking to take the trailer. We'll start looking for places to, to stop uh, there very soon. And but yeah, Matt, when are we going? Yeah. So it's it's a very tight time frame <laughs> if we want to go before we go to Las Vegas. So mm -hmm. Las Vegas is at the beginning of August, and we have things leading all the way up to that, except for the last weekend, possibly mm -hmm. in uh, July. So we'll we'll just have to see. We may do it that that soon, but more than likely it's probably going to end up being mid to late August mm -hmm. whenever we start this whole thing. And so, but hey, Vegas, hey, <laughs> hey <laughs> Vegas. Yeah. So we left y'all off in the last video, just telling y'all that we're going to Vegas. We are not taking the trailer because of the reason why we're going is we're going with um, a really good friend of his, a friend of ours. And his wife, they have a timeshare in Vegas? They do. They, they bought into a timeshare. And so, uh, but they also have to pick up their kids who are in California visiting someone. So it's a whole thing. So we're riding up with them. We're road tripping up. Yeah, road tripping with up. Them. I'll, going over, over to San Diego, I think. And then heading back through, like, hopefully Joshua Tree area. We'll see. To, to kind of check that out and then head up to Las Vegas. And then so. we're staying at, at a timeshare. In right, Vegas. Right on the strip, I believe. Really? I think so. Dang. Okay. So, okay. Yeah. So we're going to be coordinating with them, of course, uh, what we're doing. There's one thing in mind that I know that we're doing. We haven't bought the tickets yet, but... <laughs> I guess maybe wait till you buy the tickets. I'm really excited. <laughs> um... Yeah, I, I don't. I really don't know what to expect. Uh, a lot of you guys have recommended a ton of really cool things, so I need to have him look at the the comments and then relay to Casey, his friend, um, and we'll figure out what to do. But I think he's kind of familiar with the area. He's I been think there he already has times. some things in mind that he wants to do. Yeah. I know there's a meow wolf there, so maybe we'll take them there. Um, I'm curious to see if the one in Vegas is any different. And that place was so awesome. The fact that we can go back within a couple months is pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Um, but I'm really excited. I'm also nervous because we will be flying back after Vegas. I don't fly a lot. 
it's not bad at all. Driving, I don't mind. Flying is is just different. The next couple weeks, uh, we're just going to be wandering around Texas here. Wednesday's video, I'm really excited to show y'all where we went yesterday. Um, those of you guys on Patreon will have seen some of the footage already. Absolutely beautiful. I don't know why I'd never been there before and it was only an hour from us so yep. um, definitely a cool place for you guys to check out if you're passing through the area so keep an eye out for that video what else do we have we've got um, a friend a friend of mine has a birthday party on Saturday so we'll be in Wimberley so maybe we'll hang out in Wimberley we'll see for a bit um, we'll see. we drove through there yesterday getting to the place that we went to and I miss that town I went to high school in Wimberley it's a cute little town a ton of cool shops so if you guys have never been there I think it'd be neat to do a vlog from there and show some of the shops and then go down like River Road, <clears throat> show the Maybe river. Hit up memory Lane. Memory Lane. <laughs> We're, I know we probably seem kind of scatterbrained because we are. Because we are. We've got a lot going on, but hey, that's that's part of the journey. And But that's also one yeah. of the things that I'm looking to do is kind of collect ourselves a little bit. And then so, yeah. We're gonna try. Hopefully we'll get a calendar going soon and hopefully get uh, with that calendar kind of a shot list, you know? So we, like actually do this vlog thing right. You know, get actually a list of things we wanna do while we're out. Is there a right way to do it? Supposedly, I don't, I don't think know. so. The right way is the way that you do it. Okay. <laughs> well, on that note. <laughs> on that note, um, we're gonna go, I'm gonna actually edit this video that y'all are watching right now. He's gonna get to work, I'm gonna get to work. And that's it. So we will see you guys in Wednesday's video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for sticking along with our madness. Yeah. <laughs> Through everything. Yeah. Um, hopefully y'all are enjoying. Make sure you hit that thumbs up and leave us a comment below. Well, y'all have fun out there. Bye guys.